Hey there, my name is John. Today we're diving into the awesome world of Git, VS Code, and GitHub. But don't worry, we're keeping it simple, and we've got lots of animations lined up to help make sure you're un you understand what's going on. So what is Git? Think of Git as a super smart time travel machine for your code. It keeps track of the changes you made, and you can jump between any version of your project. It's like having a magical undo button for your code. Now let's dive a little bit deeper into the fascinating world of commits and branches in Git. Imagine your project is like a storybook, and each commit is a chapter. When you start working on a project, Git creates a main branch, the default storyline. Now, every time you make a change to your code, whether fixing a bug or adding a cool feature, you create a commit. A commit is like a bookmark in your story. It captures a snapshot of your code at that exact moment, including all of the changes you've made. But here's the beauty. Commits don't just capture what changed, they also remember why it changed. You can leave notes with each commit, explaining your thought process. It's like leaving behind breadcrumbs for your future self or your team, helping everyone understand the evolution of your code. Now let's talk about branches. Imagine if your story could have multiple plot lines. That's what branches are in Git. You can create a new branch to experiment with a new idea or fix a specific issue without affecting the main story. It's like writing an alternate ending to your code novel. For example, let's say you're working on a cool feature. You create a new branch, work on the feature in isolation, and then when it's ready, you merge it back into the main branch. It's like seamlessly integrating your alternate ending into the main storyline without any chaos. Branches make collaboration a breeze. If multiple people are working on the same project, they can each have their own branch, preventing conflicts. Once their work is complete, they can merge it back into the main branch. It's like weaving together different storylines into a cohesive narrative. And if a branch doesn't work out, or you want to go back to a previous version, no problem. Git lets you switch between branches, and even time travel back to a specific commit. It's like having a magical pen that can rewrite any part of your code story. In essence, commits and branches in Git provide a powerful way to manage the evolution of your code, allowing for experimentation, collaboration, and a robust history that helps everyone understand the journey your code has taken. So, as you embark on your coding adventure, remember to commit your changes and branch out fearlessly. Happy coding! Next, we have VS Code. It's like your coding playground, a friendly space where you can write and test your code. VS Code makes it easy with its cool features and extensions. It's like having a trusty sidekick while you code. Importantly, VS Code is an extensible text editor, not an IDE. So while you can make it do everything that you need, it's not cumbersome to use, and it's super fast. Now, imagine if you could share your code and collaborate with others seamlessly. That's where GitHub comes in. GitHub is like a community center for your code. It's a place where you can store your projects and work with others, no matter where they are in the world. The magic happens with remote repository hosting. It's like having a backup of your code in the cloud. You can push your changes to GitHub, and then others can pull them down. It's a team of coders working together, even when they're miles apart. And there you have it. Git for version control, VS Code for coding fun, and GitHub for sharing and collaborating. So go ahead. Explore, and remember, coding is an adventure, and these tools are your trusty companions. Happy coding!